Hello everyone, welcome to STEC. My name is Santhal. In this video, I'm going to uh, pair the Google Nest audio that I got, like two speakers that I have on both sides of the TV as stereo speakers, and then try to pair it up as speakers for the Google TV with Chromecast. Okay, so let's get into this video. Okay, before I go ahead and uh, do the uh, stereo speaker setup and also the pairing of those speakers, I'm going to just test out how the TV sound looks like with some uh, trailer. That way, uh, we, we can just check how that's going to sound once the uh, speaker setup is done. Okay, so for this purpose, I'm going to just uh, bring up a movie trailer and then we can see how it sounds. Okay. Play Transformers movie trailer. So there was recently a trailer for Transformers. So I'm just going to play the Transformers Rise of the Beast uh, official trailer here. Hopefully there is no, um, there is no copyright issue in playing the trailer, but I'm just going to try it anyway. So let me just play this. Okay, I think this pretty much good. So let me just go back. Okay, so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to set up the uh, the Nest Audio, both the Nest Audio that I got as uh, stereo speakers. So for this purpose, I'm going to go go ahead and open the um, the Google Home app. Okay, so I'm going to open the Google Home app right now. So as you can see going ahead and opening. Now let's just check the two speakers that I have got. As you can see here, this is living room speaker one. So I'm just going to increase the volume. Yeah, let's go to the maximum. So as you can see here, that's the one on the left. And then I'm going to go back now and do the second speaker. That's the one on the right. Yeah, so it's responding. So I'm just going to go back to one of the speakers. Sorry, that's TV. I'm just going to go to one of the speakers and then go to uh, settings. Okay. And then audio. So as you can see here, there is an option called setup stereo pair. So I'm just going to click on that. Okay, once you click on that, then it says, okay, pair two speakers to create a wider sound stage and all that, okay, to start place both speaker in the same room. So, of course, these two uh, speakers are in the same room in the in the Google app as well, in the living room. So, I will just say next. Now, automatically, it chooses the one that it can pair with, which is the speaker two. So, I'm just going to go ahead. Okay, which one did it make the sound and blinking? So right now it's on the left. So I'll just say left. Mm -hmm. And then I will say living room, speaker, pair. I, I just give, give that as a name. Okay, next. So now it's pairing. Yeah, so now 
you can see here now the volume control is there for the pair the, the whole uh, now the individual speakers are gone so right now I have it as a pair here right so let me just check the volume now now it's syncing the volume in both the both the speakers at the same time yeah so as you can see the light is coming up at the same time now what I'm going to do that's all with the ho ho the Google Home app now so now we just go back up and then go to the TV now yeah so on the top here go to settings okay and then go to the let me see it should be the devices yeah okay remote and accessories so I'll just go ahead and do this search for pairing okay now we have to wake the devices up uh, and put it in pairing mode so we can do it two ways either through the app or by saying the command so I'm just going to try the command mode now so you can see Bluetooth pairing sure to connect open Bluetooth settings and look for the device called living room speaker pair okay there you go so it's showing up already and I will just choose and it says pairing okay Bluetooth pairing requires living room do you want to pair it yeah pair okay so now it's connected as you can see here now it's saying is it's connected okay so let's go back and just check whether it can play the same sound or the same um, transformers uh, trailer through the speakers now okay and we'll see how the sound is so you can see here now i'm controlling the volume through the remote of Google uh, Chromecast and you can see both the speakers are showing you know the volume up and down which is good right so let me just now play Transformers trailer okay same thing again let me just go ahead and play this So we want to watch out for the exact uh, we want to watch out for the exact uh, the time that you know the the character speak so let's see if
okay so this definitely works good i just tested it as you can see now i'm going to just go into the apple tv so the, because the youtube and the apple tv are the two things that i use most of the time or 90 percent of the time so i'm just going to go into the um youtube app and maybe play for example uh let's see the joker movie uh, just i'm going to just play the trailer here I just want to see the dialogue sounds good. So let me just play the Joker trailer as well. Yeah, there seems to be no lag at all. You just ask the same questions every week. How's your job? Are you having any negative thoughts? All I have are negative thoughts. And finally, in a world where everyone thinks they can do my job, check out this guy. Okay, so it definitely sounds good. So the last test that I want to do is I want to turn off the TV and then turn on again and see if it's still connected to the speakers, right? So turn off. Okay, it's completely off now. Turn on. Okay, so let's see. Let's just go to the... Uh, the settings and see if it's connected still go to the remote and accessories yeah so the living room pair tv is still connected which is good okay so i think that's all for this video today so the pairing is pretty simple the stereo pairing is pretty simple you just need the google home app and you can choose one of the speakers and go to the device info and and or audio info and then try to do the stereo pairing which is what i did and once you do it, then you can just connect it as a speaker through the Bluetooth uh, to the Google Home TV, right? Uh, or Google TV with Chromecast, uh, which comes with a remote like this. Okay, so it pretty much works really well. I'm happy. So I'm just going to use these as speakers for the TV whenever I watch a movie. So that's all for this video today. I just wanted to show how to do the stereo pairing and then test out whether it works well with the uh, the google tv with chromecast which it does especially for the two apps that i majorly use one for the youtube and then one for the um, apple tv app so for both of them it works really well so that's all for this video today thank you for watching please like share and subscribe for more contents like this thank you